For very little money and even fewer brains, zombies have been taking our virtual headshots for years, but it would seem their union has finally put its proverbial foot down and gotten angry enough about the issue to, uh, raise the dead. This is what happens when the zombie union revolts. This is Zombie Tycoon, the fourth most downloaded PlayStation Mini of all time, and a game which gives the undead a chance at redemption. Zombie Tycoon is essentially a real-time strategy game in which players control and command an undead army on a mission to bring about a zombie apocalypse. An objective you achieve by, among other things, hitting people with fish. This dastardly plan is set in motion by a story with plenty of awesome cliches. You've got the mad scientist, the mad scientist's assistant, a green potion with the power to resurrect corpses, it's totally run-of-the-mill stuff, but it's a lot of fun, and the presentation both in-game and during its well-animated cutscenes is spot on. For example, you can equip your zombies with some hilarious weapons, not to mention dress them in cow suits, uh, attach balloons to their heads. It's fun stuff, and the game's presentation definitely complements its colorful tone. Indeed, you can't say the game doesn't have style, but in terms of substance, well, the brains leak out of the jar a bit. First off, the game feels a bit limited. There are only three zombie types available, and each group is limited to just eight zombies at a time. So in total, your zombie army is really just a gaggle of a few dozen. But to be fair, this is a 54 megabyte mini, so the relative thinness is certainly understandable. But still, keep in mind, this is a game you'll breeze through in just a few hours at the most. Aren't, you know, aren't zombies supposed to be slow? Now, to the game's credit, Zombie Tycoon uses a beautifully simple control scheme that makes preemptively striking sleepy villages a smooth endeavor, if not a very moral one. Now, each of your three zombie squads is assigned to a button, so pressing the triangle sends green zombies to attack, pressing the square commands red zombies to attack, you get the idea. Now, it's simple, but it definitely allows for enough multitasking to lend your invasion some strategy, which the game really requires in some of the later levels. You can press the X button to send them all. I mean, come on, zombies don't strategize, and neither do I. Zombie Tycoon isn't a bad game whatsoever, but it's nowhere near as compelling as the premise would seem to promise. The presentation is solid, and the humor is definitely in the right place, but in the end, the game just falls a bit short. Literally. <laughs>